I'm Caitlin, and I'm an intern in the Human Resources Department. I work with the wellness program and coordinating all of the forms that are filled out, entering different information to the system. Um, I work on a, a lot of projects that are assigned to me by my supervisor um, and then other people within the HR department. So one of the main projects I was working on was the underwriters and seeing, you know, what what's the most important that we can see with the underwriters that we've hired? Are there any patterns and correlations to see, you know, maybe their GPA doesn't matter as much, but their assessment score is really important. So let's focus more on that when we hire in the future rather than their GPA. So that's a project I've been working on. So different projects will be assigned to me like different weeks. So I like it. I had no idea that there was this much into insurance, all the different facets of it. So. I would definitely consider it, yeah. It's definitely, I've learned a lot about it. I would say before I did the internship, it was probably pretty low, but now it's, it's definitely really high. I would look for um, positions in insurance, and I wouldn't rule them out right away. So, If you are a student you know, who hasn't graduated yet, try an internship so you can learn a lot about it. Because I've interned in other industries, and I've learned just in the insurance industry so much about it, more than I've learned about the other industries that I've interned in. So maybe shadow, do a job shadow, and just learn as much as you can about the different areas of insurance that you can work in. So learning about the commercial line, the personal lines, then you have the marketing and sales, and then you have IT, HR. There's just so many areas that somebody could go into. Like I didn't know anything about insurance, and just being here for a few weeks, I've learned so much about it in that short amount of time. So I think, and I'm not even indirectly insurance, so just nice.